Whoa! This is the illusion reporting from somewhere on Spaceship Earth. <sighs> so, I got all fired up on this coffee cup idea, right? Like, what could go wrong? They came out bitching. Well, <laughs> I figured out what went wrong. So I went down to the post office to ship the first batch and the shipping cost on these things is so extreme, it blew my mind. They cost almost as much to ship as my big pieces of art. It's a one pound box, one pound, two ounce box. Six by six box costs almost $13 to ship to the East Coast. And I was charging five. So I'm sitting there in the post office and I instantly go into fear, right? I'm not stopping though. I'm completing my orders, man, because I followed through. And this isn't a poor me video. This is about, about what it is. Because for the first time since the fire, I've, I've, I felt the fear. Like the real fear. And the fear isn't like fear of like impending doom. It's fear of... Ha <laughs> it was my, my dentist calling to get the crown put in to finish the, finish the process. So where was I? So I'm, I'm sitting there. I autographed the bottom of them too. Um, so I was sitting there at the post office, right? And sticker shock was hitting me. And I realized that basically... All said and done, I was just breaking even. And then I sat there and I was like, you know, all the people who ordered it are all my loyal v viewers. So it's it's all good anyhow, because in a perfect world, I just give them the coffee mugs. So um, I was sitting there and all the, what what got me, what, what was the fear? The fear was of me realizing that like I felt stupid. That was the first vibe I got was like, I'm an idiot. And, and I, trust me, I went and researched on Etsy for about an hour. I went and looked up coffee mugs and I checked out shipping and I was like, and all the shipping was about six bucks, six, seven bucks. And I was like, all right. That's cool. That works. So I charged five. I figured, you know, and the thing, and I was like, it was all going to be good. And then I get down there, it's $13. I was like, oh my God. So it instantly sent me into fear. Like, and again, it's, I'm not afraid of like financial fear. It's fear of what am I going to do? How am I going to pull this off? Which is really different. Because I know in the end, it's all going to work out. But like, it just got me into fear about everything, everything. And I, so I got home, I walked back from the post office, defeated, completely crushed, like, ah, uh, whatever. And uh, I was like, what am I gonna do? I got all these coffee mugs now, like, and I pulled the plug on my Etsy thing for a second to regroup. And, um, yeah, and then and then I stoke each coffee cup out with with some stickers. I get you get you get a, you get you get one of each sticker in your coffee mug, dude. And uh, so I, I got super. Uh, I was like super got fearful, and then I got home and I sat here for a minute and I got it's you know it's I just dropped Al off at school. It's pretty early in the morning, and I was like, what am I gonna do? What am I going to do? And I was like, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to box up the rest of these coffee cups. I'm going to pray. I'm going to realize everything's going to be okay. And I'm going to make this video about not giving up on yourself. See, I, I, that's the thing. It's like this believing in yourself truly is a full-time job. Because there's no handbook how to do what I'm doing. Like, you know what? I can go, 
I could go right now, walk across the street and get a job at a job site and start banging on wood for, for whatever and be miserable. Or I go for it in life. I really go for it. But going for it requires a lot of like getting through scary moments. And the scary moment I would say ultimately like because the realization was like standing in the post office of truly being alone on the human level. Like I know God's got me. I'm fully, I have my faith. But I mean, like, it was the first moment, like, I think, where I was like, oh, whoa, dude, like, I don't have no, there's no one to reassure me that's going to be okay. Like, like, if you make comments or whatever later, like, yeah, that, that'll, that, that, that'll, but right here, right now, me making this video, is this is me overriding everything in my mind that tell, that wants me to go lay down and be depressed. It wants me to go lay down in my bed and be bombed and feel defeated and feel crushed and all of that good stuff. But you see, I can't do that, man, because I got to believe in myself. And so I keep, I keep moving because it says so right on the cup, dude. 2019 just ignore it and this is what I need to ignore is my mind telling me that I'm an idiot that I'm a failure I made a giant mistake yes I did am I an idiot no because I I did I I went and researched it I went and did the thing I even looked up on the United States Postal Service website and it was like seven something I was like all right like that's reasonable. I can suck up that part of the whole thing. And, uh, no. So I, I, I made, I went proactive. I called my buddy who's coming over to make, make, take photos so I can get them digitized so I can make, um, so I can make prints of my art, right? I'm going to keep trying again, dude. I'm going to call the t-shirt guy when I'm done with this video and see about getting the t-shirts made. T-shirts seem to be the way to go, dude. Let me tell you, dude. Shipping's easy. Packaging's easy. <laughs> the whole thing's relatively easy. And, um, so yeah. Wait, one second. I have I have my little system here and and um and yeah but but the 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 level of fear that overwhelmed me sitting there was was pretty radical because believing in yourself means that I'm believing in myself that's me that's not, God already believes in me. I have to believe in myself. There's no one, there's no one to come, there was no one to come home to and be like, oh my God, blah, 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 blah. That person didn't believe in me. So I got to believe in me. And let me tell you, dude, it's going to be okay. It's going to be okay. <clears throat> And you know why it's going to be okay? Because it always ends up okay. It's going to be great, actually. <sighs> you know, because for, for a second I was like, uh, I'm not even going to, I'm not going to include the two stickers in the coffee cups, dude. You know, I'm going to save 50 cents. Right? Like, no, dude. No. I know what this is all about. It's all about persevering. It's all about overcoming the obstacles in life and not going and laying down and sticking my thumb in my mouth and feeling sorry for myself. I got my ass kicked today at the post office. We regroup. 
we keep moving man and that's what this is all about dude is we overcome the obstacles in our path by moving through them and not pretending that they didn't happen because you see I think that's it to wrap this up is if I were to pretend that this didn't happen and I didn't have the initial waves that I felt I wouldn't do it but you know here we are I don't know how it all works man but if I don't show up for myself it's never gonna work if I quit it's never gonna work if I fold up camp it's never gonna work man the only way it's gonna work is if I keep showing up man keep putting one foot in front of the other I package these things up I walk down to the post office at least I know when I walk down to the post office today like whatever and I, I move through this thing and I regroup that's all we do man we just take it on the chin we smell the leather, we learn what the, the leather was all about, and we move on. All right, this is the illusion, fired up from the dream. I am truly fired up. When I started this video, not so fired up. But see, that's what it's all about, man. The value of this experience is right here. Anyway, signing off. Ha oh. ha. I got smoked at the post office on the coffee cup deal. You live, you learn, man. The coffee cups are limited edition. That's for sure. Trippy, man. So yeah, what you, so what's the, the lesson here? What is the lesson here? Tough to make a buck. That's the lesson, man. Holy smoke. It's crazy what, it's crazy it costs less to ship a piece of art. All said and done. All said and done, it costs less for me to ship a, a two foot by three foot piece of art in the United States than it does to ship a coffee mug. <laughs> Oh, the comedy of it all. The comedy of it all. Oh, well, we just keep moving through the dream, and um, that's all we can do, dude. That's all we can do.